I'm not gonna cry, I'm make me wanna cry. <laughs> Perspective really helps. My dream since I was like 13, I'm 22 now, has been to be a content creator. And I've just been making like TikToks. What's really hard for me is like, I have a lot of confidence in like my abilities and like I believe in myself a lot, but there was a lot of people like commenting on my appearance, which is something that I can't help. For some reason, I believe it every time. Like I believe that they say I'm ugly, I believe it. And it, it makes me like not want to post anymore. Other people's opinions are the greatest way to go to unhappiness. One opinion, you of yourself, is the easiest way to get to happiness. You hold too much value in the collective outside world's opinion and you need to systematically from this day on chip away at that and make them matter less. So when you feel exactly like you just talked about, I think you should make pretend that your parents died in a car accident. I'm talking about real shit. I'm talking about really imagining like the things that would make you cry. Like I always do this, like on the day when you got your nastiest 50 comments on TikTok, you getting a phone call from your mom crying that your grandma died, how much do you give a fuck about TikTok? I would not care at all. That? Yeah. How old's your grandma? My grandma's 85. You'll be lucky if you have another 100 hours with your grandma. Every 20 minutes you spend on crying about Rick Thompson saying you look shitty is 20 minutes you could be FaceTiming your grandma. I'm not gonna cry, I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> Perspective really helps, Michelle. You know what I mean? Yeah, it does. This is practice. This is, you and I are doing push-ups right now. You know, yeah. that kind of, like helping people realize things they don't see. When you realize, holy fuck, he's right, 100 hours, maybe. The hell am I laying here for the last 40 minutes dwelling about one comment on TikTok? And it's those kind of things over and over. And what ends up happening is now you are FaceTiming your grandma. Now instead of dwelling, you are making your own content. So you're on offense instead of defense. And all of a sudden, next thing you know, next thing you know, this is now your new life. This is how you see the fucking world. Please practice that. I will, I definitely will. Wanna make pretend like I do multiple times a week, like sit there and almost meditate like, oh my God, this person died. I'll never see them again. Like let it set in because what happens then is when you go in your normal day, that other shit is fucking trivial. So you think about it even when something bad is not happening, like to just like throughout the day, if you're having a fine day, you just think about it. Michelle, I think about it every day, which is why every day is a good day. I like that. Like every day I've got shit, but because I do what I told you, it, for me, a massively bad financial thing or, or like really like nasty situation feels less than one person on TikTok saying you're ugly to you right now and I want you to be where I'm at badly. So they don't fucking matter.